Welcome back to CFC. We're doing more of this Klonoa bullshit. Oh, the bullshit. final boss. Yay. Yay for Klonoa. He did a do. Yay. But it's not over yet because we got to do more. Time to fight the purances of darkness himself. Yay. The final vision. The final vision. Yay. Look, at, Look all at all the people I saved. Look at all those Eggman's robots. Yep. 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 This game was probably sold at a cheaper price because of its length. It is a relatively short game. Yeah, it is. Why are there just not rainbow? Why, why why are there some stars in some places and oh this is the road this is the rainbow road yeah okay um there's cannons now um moon cannons moon cannons excuse me moon cannons welcome to the aurora borealis basically this boss is I need to fill up the cannons with enemies and they need to shoot them that's about it yeah this is a road. This is the rainbow room. I'm gonna fucking. Fuck you. Oh, no, please don't. He's here! <laughs> Carol, you stay back! Carol! Carl! Oh my god, it's the genie of the lamp. Is like, who the fuck are these people? I'm the fuck! He's kind of like the giant pool if he wasn't covered in. Paint. No, it's it's the fat ghost from Luigi's Mansion. Not. Yeah, it looks like the fat ghost that eats all the food. Eh, not really. It looks more like he that. He have seventeen chins. He was fucking fat though. This guy's fat too. It looks it, it's this color scheme and the shape. Oh my god, he is chubby. Uh, okay. Um, how does this? Oh, oh shit. Okay. Oh my god. So how do we have to activate the cannons? Yeah, we gotta fill them with monsters. Wow. wow. Tongue! Oh. Get off me! Oh. Get off me! Oh. Get off me! Oh. Get off me! Oh. Please. How about that whirlwind move that you have? I don't... Slow down the enemies. I don't know. Slow down the boss. So. What does this do? Okay. That was a bad one. That doesn't seem like a good one. Maybe you uh... do Does it, like, give you a shield? Shit. How do you even? It gives you a shield. Does it? I don't know. They don't explain what this ability does, and it pisses me off. <laughs> it wasn't in the PS1 game, I know that. So, Did I mean, you ever use it in the original playthrough of this game? No. I've never used the ability. Oh, shit. You... I gotta wait for him to slam down like our fish ribs. Shit. Jesus, Colton. It's They're not annoying even the little It's fuckers. not even the boss that's hurting you at this point. Shit! Wow. I don't know how to dodge that, either. Oh, he's gonna eat you now. Oh, fuck. Yes. Oh, damn You're it. Dead. You have to watch this stupid. Yeah, it is. He poops you out. I was one away from winning the boss battle. That, I'm pretty sure it's a one-hit KO. That script event is so scripted, you stand up when you come out and only instantly die. Okay. Mm -hmm. It seems like he's one of those kind of bosses, but at the same time, there's got to be a way to uh, dodge that attack. Uh, uh, you got to uh, be prepared for those fast guys, man. Damn it. Uh, so we're going to slam. I'm going to dodge that either. Shield. Shield? I don't have a shield. That doesn't it do anything. It looks like a shield. Look at it. It does, but I don't... Run into an enemy with your face. Does nothing! Okay. What the... <laughs> How did you beat this before? I don't know. You didn't Jesus. have to jump over the tongue. I tried. Okay, I don't know. It grabbed me. Yeah. Mm. Alright. Run Oh god. Come on. Oh, did I touch that somehow? Yeah, with your invincibility first. Oh, I have to. I have to oh, true. Okay, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna shoot out baddies? Yeah, he does. So, what you gotta do now is. I just got two more. I gotta jump. Jump like that. I'm gonna do another slammy. Another slammy. And it's in. Yeah. He's gonna do his tongue thing, no problem. Yeah. 
to see if I can avoid it with a simple jump. Yeah, there we go. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. Sweet. There you go. Oh, I see the cancel for now. Uh, got him. We're all loaded. Fuck you! Oh. That's the boss battle. Really? I think so. Oh, nope. Guess not. <laughs> oh, uh, yes? Yes. Nope. Maybe? Oh, I'm inside of now. I forgot about this. Oh. Oh. Mm-hmm. Uh, what is Ooh, this? Well, you see darkness. Oh, um, true. And now we're oh. fighting Taboo. We are. That's actually kind of disturbing. What was Taboo? Yeah. It didn't make s mm. Okay. What? Okay. Oh, well, at least now that you're here, you can actually survive. Can I jump over that? Is that a wall thing? No, maybe? I don't know. You hit those things? The, the, yeah, I can jump over them. The, the red things? Yeah, they're... No, I don't. Oh, oh they're, 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 they're in front. They're in front, so I'm gonna shoot them for Go over. Oh, yeah. there we go. Oh, okay. I think I'm out. Oh, oh. There we go. Good job. Yeah, this is it's kind of anticlimactic. Yeah. Hopefully, if you die in this, do you have to start it back? At the I don't remember, honestly. You don't die. But yeah. there wasn't a checkpoint, so I mean, probably won't do it. Oh, that's a phase one, I guess. There's a blue one now. Nope. Nope. It's off over here. Nope. Let's do that. Oh, 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 I got this, I got this. Stay in there. Mm-hmm. Shit. Jump! Because I'm trying to align myself with it. Ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, I'm a fucking monster. Let's see. Yes! Thank God. God damn it. God damn it, Colton! Whoosh. Oh, so well. You're way too heat. No, come back! Baby, come back. Ooh. It's it, it is difficult, yes, but at the same time, just plan. Yeah. This is yeah, very difficult, to be honest. It's no, not that difficult. It's not. It, it's not. Okay. Like this is pathetically easy for a final boss, for any boss in general, really. No, it is. It's another, just it's jump not the over main... the lasers, pick up the thing, and to be throw fair, it it's not the whole part of the final boss. It's a phase of it. What? Okay. Come on. So I'll give it that. To be a phase that you can actually do damage to, it's different. There we go. This part's a little trickier. Yeah. Okay, so I gotta wait for it to start moving for real before I start throwing shit out. There we go. Oh, you, you. oh you can hit it from behind him. Yeah. No! You know, if he didn't make these enemies, he... I know, right? Reminds me of Face from Nick Jr. <laughs> Hi there, Face here. A fucking demented ass version of Face. And then they made him like a f made him flash, and he looked terrifying. So what's happening now? Uh, you beat the game. Oh, no. oh, oh this yeah. is the one. Oh, garage. Oh my God. Yes, Chris is on now. Oh yeah, the, the things are down there now. Oh man, that didn't go too well, guys. You beat the shit out of him. Um, we're going to stay out of sight down here. Uh. Oh. So it's another one and done thing. Okay. Oh. 
He's sucking some. Oh, he's eating the platforms! Alright, there you go. Does that satisfy you, Sean? Yeah, not really. It's hard. Shit, not really. Not really. Not wrong. Yeah, this is even more basic. Yeah, I mean, you gotta worry about destroying platforms. You gotta worry about rainbow road waves. I don't know. This appears just... easier than the flying, dude. This is easier than the first fucking one. First one can form new problems. Big flying color dude, where you take the big tip gems that look harder than this. Yeah. I don't. Shit, shit, fuck. Oh, Start phase one. Oh my god. Yeah, if you uh, somehow manage to make it to this point and you die, you have to go all the way back to phase one. Oh my god, I fucking hate this game that was true. There you go. It's all about the timing. No, this doesn't look hard. This there, looks it's, fun. it's a matter. It's like a ma it looks fun, but like the thing is, this is a final boss, so it should yeah. be a bit more challenge. Mm, I don't think necessarily challenge. I don't, I don't. I don't. I don't know. I don't. I'm not in the mentality that it has to be challenging in order to. Be I don't know. Final boss should have. Some challenge. Yeah, it should have some challenge. Like, I don't. I don't necessarily. I. I don't. I, I. I. disagree to an extent. Yes, a final boss should be a bit more difficult. But to be fair, like it would be really cool is that if this like, is sometimes the platforms would just stay disappeared for a while, so you can't go that way for a bit, and yeah. then they regenerate, not instantly come back. Then I'd be like, oh yeah, this is the thing. But the fact that he just doesn't attack, the platforms go away, and then they instantly come back. To be fair though, this was a remake, so they kind of just damn it. God damn it. It, the timing is weird, though, with throwing the enemies. Like, that's one of the challenges, because- By this point in the game, you should know the timing required to do it, though. Yeah. <laughs> he should. <laughs> I still say the challenging- the, 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 the timing it can still be off, even for people that are good at throwing shit. Because when you- when you throw it, it's not just an immediate sort of, like- Oh, I thought it was just that's probably the hardest part, is throwing the stuff. The music in this game is pretty good. It is. Oh yeah. Not a doubt. You almost died that way last time. Nope. Nope. Too late again. Like, I think that's the hardest part of it, is just the timing of throwing these things. And that's supposed to be the biggest challenge. Avoiding the platforms and avoiding the enemies is not, is not really a huge, like, hard part of this. It's making sure that you're actually able to get the... Because there are, there are, the sweet spots are a lot smaller than you think they are. Yeah. Because you would think of it like... There you go. You have to touch the rim of the cannon. You can't just touch the thing itself. What? No, I jumped! Fuck! Oh, damn. Why do you gotta do this? Why you gotta be so rude? He's not rude, he's just not doing it. Rude. See, yeah, everything else about this is fine. It's just getting the fucking uh, enemies in the bot and the cannons to shoot at him is probably the hardest part about this. And even then, that's if that's the hardest part. Oh, oops. But again. This kind of boss, it's not really anything new for the norm of that time period, so. I mean, Drunken Giant Bowser had a much bigger scale, but it was just shooting eggs at an enemy. But to be fair, and, and, and yeah, there's a lot more going on than just that. Because in this, you have to worry about platforms that can disappear, but in the, bo the the baby Bowser fight, platforms disappear and they are gone for the rest of the battle. That's fire! What? Okay, run! Run, 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 run. Like, when did you get into the topic of, uh, Mario? I was talking about how this boss- I was talking about final bosses of the, from that time period. This came out in 1997. I win! Yeah, you win! I was talking about the boss- final bosses and how they were scaled. In 1997, this came out, and this was the boss fight. Right, Colton? Yeah. Verbatim. Well, in 3D. We're almost done! Oh. A wind bullet? That is the 
shooting thing. Uh, but herpes? Wait a minute. <laughs> herpes? No! Don't sacrifice yourself! No! <laughs> okay. That makes his last shot. Herpes. Fucking jump off the edge. <laughs> Make this last shot. Oh, I don't even get the fucking choice. Yeah, yeah. Make this last shot. Colton's playing. Fuck! Oh, <laughs> no. We gotta do the whole. It's like phase one. Hadouken! Basically. Uh, you just fired another living creature into a living creature. Hit a motherfucker with another motherfucker. You know, he's right. Beautiful mentality. That's the whole point of this game. To beat motherfuckers with other motherfuckers. Basically. Welcome to the speedrun strats of Colton. Ah, uh, this wasn't tight on straight. You get so much spittle on you. You're so sloppy. That's so gross. I wonder if the capture picked that up. It did. <laughs> See. Lafice, Louise, Louisiana. It's almost over, yay! Oh. Hi, Louisiana. Oh, we saved her. Yeah. yeah. She was trapped inside the thing. I like how the inside of their mouths is just pink. Dance time. <laughs> that guy's foot isn't even on the platform. <laughs> he was just dancing, and yo, know, he should be dead. But Lou's just like, to be fair, wifey. to be fair, this does this. Yeah, it it, it is kind of a. I mean, it looks good, but I wouldn't say it looks good as say something like Sonic Colors or how Mario Galaxy. Mario Galaxy is the golden standard for weeb graphics. We are together, Clanwa. Speaking of other third-party uh, Wii games that you were interested in, Colton, Crystal Bears. Did you like it? I didn't even play it that much. My copy, like, fucking broke. It doesn't work well. Oh, okay. We'll be together forever. That looks in my pajamas. Herpes, you're okay. Yay! I'm so confused. <laughs> so, such a derpy design. Yeah, you like, die. this just, it doesn't look like it should, it, this looks like early PS2 almost, in some aspects. Oh man, it's, like, sanctuary. it's, it's like it's a Wii. No, you know what I mean, like... The sanctuary, uh, fears of ice melts away. It, it, like, most of the game looks great, but some models just look off. Yeah. yeah. And the Wii is more powerful, slightly, very slightly more Time powerful than the PS2. Time for the ending so. scene. Isaiah knows what happens. Are you feeling it? Yes, Mr. Krabs. Yay. Yay, we did it. Hey, Herpes, listen. Hmm. Dot, doo -doo, dot, doo -doo, dot, dot, Um. Silence. Ellipses. Um. Missing Clonoa. I'm gay. <laughs> Good. I'm gay too. Tongues. Ah. And then they kissed. Oh. You're part of a video game series? Um. <laughs> what? Yeah, so the Moon Prince created a new identity for this guy, brought him in from his world, wiped his memory, created his grandpa for him to do this. Yeah. The game doesn't even have a happy ending! Um... Yeah! This is very sad! Oh. Sean said no. Oh. Yeah. This is the whole point. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Oops. You okay there, buddy? Oh, you gonna be okay there? Said it. Doing some chain of memories bullshit. Yeah. It's a good thing we started rambling on Kingdom Hearts songs. <laughs> yeah. This dream. He was talking about. Oh. 
Um, yeah, so the world he comes from is just nothing but fairy tales in their world. Wait, this is a world of fairy tales? or No, the world that Klonoa comes from. It's fairy tales. Yeah. But both worlds are real. Yeah. But it doesn't exist in this world. It's another dimension of sorts. Yeah. What? Um. Yep. This is depressing. Yeah. It's now she sings the song of rebirth to fix everything. That's a lovely song. Yeah. Oh no! Okay. Um. Oh. No way! I don't wanna go! Is this. Uh. Herpes, no! Go with me. Ruin the balance. So, the whole point of this game was that it was all a dream. Well, technically, he's the dream. That's an actual real world. Does he remember it, though, when he wakes up? Mm -hmm. Does he try to go back? He gets, he gets sent back to his world. With only the memories from here, they don't restore his memories at all. He doesn't remember his world at all. Wow, Herpes is a dick. Yeah. Well, really, the Moon Priestess is a dick. They didn't let him do anything. She's like, no, oh, we're gonna rebirth everything now. They're dicks. Yeah. So how does he get his? Does he get his memories back in that game? Or nope. It that's literally where this leaves off. Clono Two picks right back up. He's dropped into the ocean, and the Priestess finds him. He's like so fucking confused at what's going on. These guys are dicks. We need you, so we're gonna kidnap you from your world and give you memories, and then we're gonna take you back and not give we're you. We're gonna old give memories. you false trust in me. Yeah, that's literally where it leaves off at. This is where the game ends. That's literally how that's it ends. That's the end. So we have to play the second game in order to fully grasp what's going on. Yep. And unfortunately, we don't have the second game. We have to buy it at some point so we can actually. Pick I'll up. probably get it at some point, because it's a really fun game. Yeah, it's like this, but kind of better, in some ways. It's really better. It's actually a lot better. Mm. It has more than 12 levels. Well, com <laughs> com compared to the original, speaking, uh, it's better than the original, probably. Oh, yeah. But it's probably still better than this game. Oh, yeah. But the, the original needed a, to be remade in the style of this, I like, think. Like, this game, you think everything's saved. Yay, happy ending. No. They leave off there. And I'm sad. <laughs> I know, right? You know, I I know. <laughs> That's bad. I know. It's like, yay, we had an adventure. Don't you're do gonna that. Say, oh no, you're gonna send me back to my world. Oh no, you didn't give me back my memories. Oh no, I only remember this world and you and Grandpa and his grandpa. My grandpa fake, fucking yeah. exploded. And he was fake. My fake grandpa exploded. <laughs> yep. So long story short, kids. Sometimes don't, life sucks. Long story short, don't trust a fucking sprite that comes out of a ring. <laughs> long, long story short, all you could be living a lie right now. Oh, God. You, at any moment, right now, you could go on an adventure with your best friend, and you'd be like, oh, yeah, I dreamt you up. Bye. Yeah. And it's such sad and music, then, too, and like, then, listen, And like, then he doesn't even fucking give you your memories back. You're just kind of trapped in the real world that you live in, and you don't know what the fuck to do. Yeah, like, listen to this music. It's just so somber. It's just like... This is such a downer ending. Yeah. Like, this is the most downer ending game I've ever... Because it's like, compared to what the entire game actually is, like, being happy and cheerful with some dark moments, at least the game, like, Freedom Planet has, like, super dark moments, but it's balanced with having a great ending. This is it's so much fun and excitement and journey <sighs> until your grandpa fucking dies and you got it on your the grandpa sun. fucking explodes and you ride a flying dolphin to the sun it's my favorite moment of this game <laughs> <laughs> like that all happens in one scene like <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
It's, oh. it's pretty memorable, to be honest. I it, will say, though, when we do get Klonoa 2, you guys are going to fucking love it. Like, the, there's so there's just such a broader cast of characters that's so awesome. It's wonderful. Klonoa. Uh, when it first came out, great game. Remake, probably even better. Yeah. Uh, it's just... The HD, the HD treatment did really well. I would on. love Namco to continue this series. I well, love... They kind of are. They did Game Boy Advance. I, no, I don't... Well, the Game Boy Advance games were released shortly after the Klonoa 2 came out, but I don't know if those games are necessarily in canon with the entire series. I don't know how those games fit into the main... The first two games. Clump. Clump. <laughs> <laughs> we should just made our character dicks. <laughs> I think Clump is funnier. Clump. Yeah, but still, it's like... I just like making a funny book. Ah, Save your progress. Oh, you're so, right. next time on Depressing Fucking Game. We'll come back to this franchise soon-ish. Well, we have another episode. We do? Oh, next time. We'll do more. Yeah. yeah.